Well, good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Part four, windows, and I'm not nervous at all. So, I've got a car around this inside bead, all the way around. The windows are here, I've just checked it all. Um, both sides are doing. Cut that out a little bit. I say a little bit. I want to cut that out. Cut that out with a grinder, and I've got a jigsaw with a metal blade. Hopefully, it does the job. Um, I'm gonna start getting a few bits ready. I'll go through the kit and everything with you in a bit. I'll get ready and then go from there. Right. So tools I am using. They might not be the right tools, but they're the tools I am using. I've got two metal blades in this pack. Fine toothed metal blades from Screwfix. I've got my drill to cut the corners to make the holes in each corner. I've got my jigsaw. I've got my grinder to get these bits out. And to be honest, if the jigsaw fails, I'm using the grinder to cut them out. The butcher of Berkshire. Um, I file, file it down and uh, tradesman stands, obviously. Two wheelie bins, that's what they was made for. And more importantly, hold on, safety goggles. More important than anything. So, I've got the bonding kit for two windows. So, you get enough rubber that comes with it. You get the actual bonding Wherever that stuff is. That was ice cold. It's been in the shed for a couple of days, so I've put it in some warmish water just to warm up a bit because I can see that being a pain in the backside getting out. So them two. <clears throat> You've got prep M. Now apparently this stuff, all the videos I've watched, they use a black paint primer. Well apparently this is what you use instead of the primer. You wipe it around and it's a um a fixing Hey, I'm, I'm gonna sound technical now and I have no idea but yeah that is instead of the black primer okay, two cleaning pads wipes that is what you put the primer on with and some gloves so with one of my son's colouring pens let's try and go along that line Black on black, that's what I like to see. Well done, Tom. That's enough. <clears throat> and the same again there. I bet the professionals are absolutely screaming at the screen already. I don't care. There's my lines. Right, wish me luck. And remember. <laughs> Not the straightest in the world, but that one's alright. That one's a bit downhill. It'll be alright, I'll grind that. Once I take that off, I'll tidy that up a bit. Whew, smoked out in here. So I've gone all the way around the outside and the corners with some drill holes. Just to make it a bit easier going around the corner. And it looks pretty.
Right ladies and gentlemen, we have a window. No we don't. Right ladies and gentlemen, we have a hole. Right, there's a few little mistakes I've made that I don't really want you to make, so I will go for them. But I'm just gonna get the oh. thing here and grind her down. Right, the edges are cleaned up. They don't have to be perfect because the rubber beading goes over it. So now oh, we put the seal on. Right, that seal's on and I'll be honest with you that covers a lot you don't have to be as careful with the cut as I thought you had to be because that rubber seal covers loads obviously you've got to be careful but little bits that I thought would have stood out it's been covered nice right so we now use this prep M and this pretty little cloth here and we go around the black bead of the window not over the clear glass just around the black bead the band and the oh, all along here as well just to clean it off and that is the bonding agent in it as well bonding is that the right word well, that's what it is anyway Take 
and we have a window. I will go through. There's a few bits I messed up on, and I'm not going to lie and hide it. I'll go through it all in a second. Right, so it was just in time. It's just starting to rain. Um, so yeah, I won't be doing that side definitely. Um, what was I going to say? Yeah, I was going to apologise a bit for the, the camera skills. Not that it was it was on purpose, but um, one of them was I left the camera in here when I was putting the resin round. Um, and two, the camera fell over out there when we stuck the window to the door. So things happen, unfortunately, when you're filming it. You can't get an outtake and take the window off and redo it. It's just all unedited and off we go. So yeah, I apologise for them little bits, but hopefully let's give you an idea. Right, so let's get to the mistakes I made. Right, that's the metal blade I had. Okay, it was not long enough. It was going in, but it was also coming back out so so that was the square of the window there it wasn't cutting like that it was cutting like that so it was jumping out and bouncing on the bodywork here and there but i changed it for or the only one other one i had was an aluminium one which is a lot longer um so i used that and once i used the aluminium one it flew for it like butter it was easy so mistake number one um but obviously you learn by them mistake number two um i taped the bottom of the cutter but i didn't realize a bit of this tape the reason i taped it is so it didn't scratch the bodywork of the van but a bit of this tape as i was going around peeled off and i didn't realize so it's left a mark around my window only a little bit just in places some of this tape has been taped on. There's a few little marks there. A few of them might buff out. But yeah, there's a few marks there. Um, and so that's mistake number two. And mistake number three. I put too much of the um, resin, whatever this stuff's called. Um, I put too much on there. I overdone it. So when I push the window on, it splurted out the sides. Which I wanted, I'd rather too much they not enough but it just meant I had to go around and clean it for about 10 minutes after with a bit of white spirits but it's come up alright but yeah for a first attempt I'm quite happy with it and like I say this rubber bead sorry it's quite dark in here isn't it this rubber bead covers a hell of a lot from the cutting so yes um, anything else? I ain't done the other side yet I could have done the other side perfect and made it out that I didn't make any mistakes at all, but I'd rather go through the mistakes I made um, on the first one because a lot of you watching will be first timers like I was with this one. So I'd rather you see the mistakes I made and then um, then you won't make them. So yeah, the window's in. I'm not going to film the other one. You don't need to see two windows going in. But yeah, so we're all done. I'm going to tidy up now. It's coming over quite dark, it's meant to rain, so I'm not going to do that other one today. But I've got one window in, I've had the experience of doing it now. Um, yeah, so if I helped you out in any way, again, like, subscribe, and thanks for watching. Just beautiful.